Uh, hello everyone, good evening, this is uh, Day Trader Rockstar for DayTradingRadio.com for a preview of the watch list, uh, actually a preview of the 104,000 watch list and some other great information uh, for the week of December 15th. Um, normally on Sundays I send out a very nice uh, detailed watch list uh, composed of at least 10 stocks um, defining their buy, uh, buy points, their sell points, their trigger areas, and technical levels. And I'm going to give you a couple of examples here, uh, just as a, uh, a preview. And um, let's see what we got here. We'll start right off with uh, Dell Computer. All right, uh, Dell Computer, you can see here, is uh, forming a nice basic uh, bottoming pattern called an inverted head and shoulders pattern. Uh, what I like about it is we're closing above the 20 period moving average. You can see the uh, the head here headline the two shoulder lines Stochastics are becoming embedded, which is very important uh, If you're not sure about the term embedded stochastics definitely uh, Try to look that up or come over to the site. I definitely have some videos about the, uh, the sto stochastic indicator And looking for a breakout of uh, Dell um, move above 12:30. So 12:30, I definitely put that on your alerts for a move above 12:30 for a buy on Dell. Uh, very nice pattern here. And let's take a look at a couple other ones here. All right, um, here we have a chart of the gold, the gold spider, uh, GLD. And as you can see, we're um, we got stopped dead right here on the daily on the 200 period moving average, but it shows a good level of resistance. What's very positive about this chart is sto stochastics are very bullish and um, gold looks like it wants to continue its move up here. Now recently we've seen a, pu a pullback in dollar in the dollar and um, gold, again gold is still in an uptrend here. We had a confirmed trend with some higher lows here. But this is not the one I'm actually uh, focusing on. I just want to give you another idea. Um, what I'm trying to look at here as we pass through some of these other stocks I've been focusing on. Uh, let me find this. Here we go. This is the uh, this is the silver iShare uh, ETF. All right, the silver ETF SLV, and you can see this nice basing pattern here. Nice, very nice basing pattern. We've been consolidating around the 20 period moving average, moving up and down. Just a nice basing pattern. This one's going to sneak up as gold is getting, uh, usually gets all the uh, attention. I think you're going to see a nice move in silver here. The buy trigger would be above 1040 on this one. That's 1040. Um, it's, uh, it's a new one on my watch list. I'll be watching silver uh, this week. And I do like the uh, setup here. Stochastics have a ways, ways to go before we get over overboard here. So this looks like we could have a good opportunity to break through that tw uh, 50 period moving average. And I have a nice little pop here on silver. Okay, um, and the last one I want to show you tonight. Uh, let me see. There's so many good ones here, but uh, Shearing Plow. Nice base here. There was a nice base. We had a nice little dip here back, um, you know, a few weeks ago. We had a little dip, dip down to $13. And come ri we came right back up and uh, started consolidating once again, holding that 20-period moving average. And we started to make a nice nice uh, area of the, of resistance here of uh, 1720. Now the stochastics are embedded again. There's that term, the embedded stochastics, which usually means there's some uh, underlying strength in the market. It's usually for, uh, foretells a market rally or a stock rally, depending on what you're looking at. So look for a break of uh, on, on your buy triggers, a uh, buy trigger of 1720 and have a target of 1820. So an easy point on that one. This one looks really set up nice for an easy, uh, on, on a break of that 1720, uh, it should give you that momentum. That momentum should come in because it is a big stock and that momentum should carry this to 1820. Easy, easy scalp play there for you. So um, that's uh, a few of the picks off the 10 for a thousand watch list. As you can see, it goes out each Sunday and there's many, many stocks on it and they're all set up showing you buy triggers and what what exactly is working on them and um, here's another ni nice one Sears holding actually a very good stock I'll be focusing on this one tomorrow too and uh, that's it we talk about the earnings don't forget this week's earnings we're gonna have Goldman Sachs coming out on Tuesday 
um, on Tuesday morning, Goldman Sachs. Uh, that's going to be the big one. Adobe after the close also. And um, Joy Global on Wednesday. Some other big ones. Uh, Take Two Interactive after the close. Nike, Micron also on Wednesday. Thursday we have FedEx. Um, let's see what else we have here. Some of the bigger ones. Palm. Rick's Cabaret. Playboy. All right. Um, so that's about it. That's it, about it. Hopefully you, uh, you're able to come by the uh, site. Uh, the site is daytradingradio.com. Uh, we broadcast the sites every day from 8.30 to 4 o'clock. Live market coverage. It's free. It's a live stream. You can could, you could pick it up on your phones. You can pick it up on your internet. Uh, you'll hear live setups, chart, chart setups, and uh, breakouts and breaking news and everything all mixed in with some great music. So hope you can enjoy it. Uh, come by. Say hi. I'm Day Trader Rockstar, and this was the uh, um, preview for the watch list for December 15th.